So in order to complete the term, I had to perform piano in front of the professors and the other students. And I was dreading this moment since the beginning of the year. I was pacing back and forth in the halls, just sweating. And I know some of you guys might be thinking, oh, come on, it's not that bad. It's probably just like public speaking. No, it isn't. Because when you're delivering a speech you wrote, you can change some words around, maybe forget to say one or two things, and no one's any the wiser. But if I play one single wrong key, one wrong note, that's it. They all know. It's over. I'm done. I might as well just flip everyone off and walk out. Because there's a stupid thing that happens when you perform and you're nervous. If you make a mistake, your brain freaks out and dies. And you forget everything you ever knew about playing the piano and the piece you've been working on for months. So here's how much I was dreading this performance. I could have gotten a phone call and it was my parents on the other line telling me my sister just committed suicide. And I would have actually seen a silver lining. Because that would mean I had an adequate excuse to tell my professors I can't do it. But they're pretentious pianists and they probably would have still been like, the show must go on. Ow, my sweat is dripping in my eyes. It's almost time. So I wander back behind the stage and I have to pee for the 12th time. And the lights dim. And the audience grows quiet. And I walk out. Hello everyone, my name is Luck and I will be performing Chopin's Scherzo number two in B flat minor. Thanks. I look at the piano. And the moment I play the first key, it begins. I pray for a plane to come crashing down. Mm. Oh no! It looks like I can't play. So it must go on. Up yours! I take a deep breath. And I'm off. So far so good, but because of my nerves I was playing faster than I would normally. But I make it to my favorite part, the part I can play with my eyes closed, the part that's never been an issue. It's the part after this that I'm worried about. It happened. All of a sudden, the piano, this piece, it all felt foreign to me. And I asked myself, why do I even do this? And I think back on all the years and how I've used my piano playing for good. I think about my first job at a retirement home, playing piano for all the old people during dinner. And every day more and more of them would die and the crowd would get smaller and smaller and I was like, wow, this is weird. I think about my job now, being a piano teacher, and seeing the eager look on those kids' faces when I tell them, there won't be lesson next week, I'll be out of town. Really? Yeah. I think about always being put on the spot when I'm at a party and there's a barely functioning keyboard and everyone is like, come on, play us something. No, no, I'm not in the mood. Come on, you gotta. No, I don't have anything prepared. Please. I'm not gonna do it! So we're back into the piano and I decided that I won't give up. I was filled with determination. And I'm back at it. I played through the piece, hitting a wrong key every other note, but I'm getting through. Ow. Just a little bit more to go. I've done 760 measures and I butchered every single one of them. But the final chord is coming up. If I can stick, I might save face. But I blow and I stumble off the bench. I stand back up, face the crowd, and bow. But they don't bow back. I'm not sure if they're supposed to. And I make my way off the stage, happy that I completed the term. And I was never to be seen again. <laughs>